Humans are naturally curious for the unknown. For centuries, researchers and scientists alike have been studying our planet and everything on it. The Earth has left many men and women wandering for years, and there is still so much to uncover. However, within the past couple decades, people have had their eye in the sky. With the population on Earth growing and the global warming and pollution issues, humans are scared that our expiration date is quickly approaching. Earth is being trashed and astronomers are looking for a new home. We have sent people to the moon and now scientists are looking a little further out. Our neighboring planet, Mars, has captured the minds of astronomers around the world. Many space probes have been sent there to retrieve data about the planet. The most widely known would be the Mars rover. These robots detected that some of the vital materials that humans need to live can be found on Mars. This is what's propelling scientists to place humans on the red planet in the near future. There is research to prove that oxygen and water have both existed on Mars at one point. However, while these findings promote the two primary elements humans require to live, Mars is still not suitable for humans to bear. One of many unavoidable safety risks is the lack of gravity during the 18-month flight that astronauts must take to get to Mars. Over time, their bones would become so weak that when the astronauts enter into Mars's gravity, their bones could snap. Another roadblock is the time that it takes to travel to Mars from Earth. Even though astronauts would be moving at hundreds of miles an hour, Mars is about 249 million miles away. It would take approximately 18 months to reach Mars from Earth, and the first human mission is said to take flight in 2024. Time is the enemy because the longer that humans are exposed to the harsh conditions of outer space, the more risk they put themselves in. One of the biggest obstacles would be the money issue to make this mission possible. It is predicted by Western countries to cost around a hundred billion dollars to complete this mission in full. This is well over the cap that the government provides for space exploration each year, so the public would be urged to fill the void. Without the promise of the amount of money they need, scientists are unable to give this mission a go. Money and time issues aside, Mars is still unsuitable for human exploration due to the health risks that the astronauts would face while on the Red Planet. Mars's weather conditions are very harsh compared to those on Earth, and has air unsuitable for humans to breathe. The most deadly condition of Mars may be its paper-thin atmosphere that provides little to no protection against the sun's radiation. If exposed to this high amount of radiation, humans could suffer through extreme radiation poisoning and the possibility of getting cancer is almost certain. Humans are programmed to be curious people, and through this trait we find out more about ourselves and the world around us. While there are still millions of creatures, plants, and places left untouched by humans on Earth, our minds tend to be in space. We shot for the moon, and now the next best thing is to shoot for Mars. 
Although taking humans to Mars would be a long, dangerous, and costly trip, it is inevitable for humans to not explore it. There was water, there is some oxygen, and there is a potential for humans to live on Mars one day. While today might not be the best time to go to Mars, in the near future, we could end up finding ourselves standing atop red soil.